The purpose of a competency-based interview is to understand how your skills and experience will fit into the requirements of the role. This is done by asking you a question that will seek to find out what actions you've taken in the past to understand what actions you might take in the future. The best technique to use within a competency-based interview is called the STAR technique. The STAR technique stands for situation, task, action, and result. It's important that you prepare for all of your answers in this way and answer them in this way. It's what the interviewer will be looking for. So to give you an example, if you were asked, tell me about a time you've had to work together in a team to achieve a common goal, the answer you would give would first have to set the situation, set the scene, tell us where you were, who you were working for, and what your job was. Then your task. What was the task you had to complete? What was the goal you were working towards as a team? And then the action is your bread and butter. What actions did you take personally and within that team to achieve the common goal? Finally, the result is the cherry on top. What was the final outcome? and always make sure it's a positive one. The best way to prepare for a competency-based interview is not to try and second guess what the actual competencies and questions are going to be on the day of the interview. The best way to prepare is to get a pen and paper one evening, sit down and think of your top five, six achievements within your career or even your education. When you do that, write them out using the STAR technique, not being biased to any one competency. And when you've finished, go back read over them and start thinking what different competencies could I demonstrate here depending on how I adapt my answer to this question. And what you end up with is a tool bag of five or six examples that could be used to answer sometimes up to 10 different competencies.